Welcome to Tidworth Park Run. So I wasn't going to vlog today, this might be a vlog light, but when I turned up, when we turned up, me and Tiny Steve, you see this and you think, yeah, need to get hold of this. Now it's a three lapper, therefore I can just do one lap and then put the camera away. I'm also not going to be able to run round it pretty quickly because I'm a bit damaged in the hip. So I've overdone it in Denmark and Sweden, in uh, Amagafell and Malmo. Because of all the steps that we were walking, I'm a bit strained and I don't want to break myself. So I'm going to take it a little easy today. Car parking wise, 50 spaces in this car park right in the centre. Oh look, there's Libby. Didn't know she was coming today. Updating about Badger. How is the bags? The Badger. Yeah. So Libby couldn't come to Denmark and Sweden and had to cancel because Badger was ill. But he's all right. Is he ten? He's doing better than what he was. Oh, he's doing much better than he was. He's yeah. home. He was in a hospital for a week. Well, I nearly passed. And he did nearly pass away. Yeah. But he's he, yeah. He's fighting back. Some very kind person out there um, in the London area donated blood from their cat. Yeah. Because you can't have stored cat blood. No. You have to have a cat which is taken and donate some blood, um, which is quite traumatic for that cat. Yep. So some very kind person out there did that. Um, if they hadn't, Badger wouldn't be here. So. There you go. Thank you very much for that person and that kitty. Look, even even Bertie's happy that the Baggins is all right. So we're in the county of Wiltshire and we're just within it. I think we're right next to Hampshire too. And this is event number two. Now I don't usually come to event number two. But it was only an hour and a bit away from where I live, just down the motorway. It was really quiet if they were in Orgel. I think it was 60 to 70 people. They kept it really quiet, which is fantastic numbers without being overwhelmed. And of course, everybody starts to see it on their maps. They hear about it and they go, right, okay, I'm gonna come on down. Hi, good morning, everybody. Like these people, look, everyone's coming, turning up to Park Run. Good morning. Beautiful weather. Let's show you around. It still astounds me as to how many places in the UK that I still haven't heard of. And Tidworth is one of these. When I saw the parkrun appear, I was like, wow, I'd never heard of Tidworth, but it's a garrison town. So I've done a bit of research on it. It has a military base very nearby, it's just north of the park. But yeah, a garrison town. And so I don't think I can run my drone because um, I won't run my drone ever during the park run. There's restrictions on airspaces in certain parts. And I have a funny feeling my drone may be geo-locked out and I won't be able to run it. I'll find out later once all the event is closed and everyone's gone. Hi Chris. Hey, right, who are you speaking to? Are you at work I'm business? Lil, Lil's just struggling to oh, Lil. Lil. Okay. But, uh, yeah, how are you doing? All right? I'm all right, thank you very much. Lil, when you see this and watch this back, <laughs> We had a few seconds trying to work out the right car park too, but we'll see you shortly. Yeah, that Danny's actually putting you on the video. Yeah. Hi. It's going to be quite meta for when you watch this back. <laughs> How you doing, mate? Anyway, you're I'm right? good, thank you very much. You, however, are not. No, new hip. New hip. Titanium hip. Do you know what? That's saying I actually have got hip issues. I can't run properly today. I might be joining you in a couple of years' time. Oh, do you know what? It was, it was hellish. I've spoken to Joe, the run director, and I've spoken to Jules Pearson, the lovely Jules Pearson, who's the ambassador for this event, and just told me it is MOD land. It's taken a long time to get this event here, and you have to be very careful, very conscious, because they've had to oblige a lot of things. So, of course, as park runners, we have an obligation to make sure we behave properly, and hopefully this event stays. Hello. You're all right, you're out of breath, we've not even started. <laughs> I think I just had a very long warm-up. Um, right, panic jog, you panic, panic jog down jogged, it. Panic jog. Are you up there in the car park? Are you up Way there? Way up there, no, even further up the road. <laughs> Are there no spaces in the car park? No, I got kicked out. <laughs> arrive early, this is why we always arrive Definitely at 8 a.m. We never have these stresses, usually. <laughs> There's a few more people than there were last week. There's a lot of people, aren't there? Everyone here is the back. Everyone here is. Just give us a wave back if you can hear us. Welcome to Tidworth Park Run. It's our second event. It's absolutely fantastic to see so many people here. So thank you very much for coming. These events aren't possible without our volunteers. So can we have a quick round of applause? Thank you, volunteers. Thank you. I 
I can't hear what he's saying because there's a noisy doggy over there. I don't know what he's saying, noisy Bertie. Thank you, Joe. Ready, get ready, lids. Enjoy. Oh, oh, hang on, no. Oh, I just started my watch. Oops. Oh, hang on. Oh, what's going on? Oh, I started and I stopped. I've had to discard and everything. Oh. Oh my goodness, it doesn't really matter anyway because I can't run properly. Right, let's have a lap. Let's go around for a lap and show you what it's like. Oh, Jules! Jules, give us a wave! Thank you, Marshall! Thank you, Marshall. Thank you, cheers. High five. I realize we can high five again now. Oh, Foof. Thank you. I'm not going on the road, I'm being very good. I'm keeping to the grass. Thank you, everybody. Thank you. Josie, Josie, come here, give me a squish. You kept this quiet. I did, I did. So glad you're here. I didn't know if you're going to be here or not. Yeah. So Josie's the ambassador for this event. It's been kept very quiet. It's on uh, Ministry of Defence land. Yep. That's why we had a soft launch. Yeah. And uh, everything going all right so far this morning? Fantastic. What you it's a marvellous team. It really is. Oh, are us tourists yeah. behaving? <laughs> they are behaving. <laughs> yeah, we had a few parking on the grass. So please don't park on the grass if you come here. There is car parking available. Yeah. But wonderful event team. They've been lovely so far and beautiful space, isn't it? It's gorgeous. Yeah, yeah. Well, as soon as I saw this, I thought, yeah, this is a place for a park run without a shadow of a doubt. Yeah, a lovely one mile lap. Just over a mile, one mile lap. Oh, okay, I'm going to get on. Yeah. Thank you for giving me an excuse to go around. Catch your breath. I hope you catch my breath. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to have to walk, run a lot of this, yeah, because yeah, I'm damaged. So, what a great uh, decision to do to come here, knowing that I can't run fully. I can take it all in, can't yeah, I? It's beautiful, enjoy. Yeah. Well oh, oh, lots of people's coming in already, look. Oh, I love Jules. Fantastic ambassador. I love so many ambassadors. They're all brilliant. They are. I'm not just saying that to pay lip service. And it's all got a bit windy now, but yeah, they do so much just because. They don't do it for the volunteer counts because it doesn't go on the volunteer counts. They do it because they love parkrun and everything it stands for and voluntarily, altruistically given their time in that sense. So, how's it going guys, enjoying it? All good. All good. So yeah, I'm loving it. I'm being sensible. I'd like to be able to run well again in the next couple of weeks. So I don't need to break myself now. My hip is feeling a bit better, but there's no point exerting it. You've already seen the first lap. I'll see you in a couple of laps time. I was about to say, can you hear that? Oh, there you go. You can hear the shooting in the background. You might not be able to hear it. It might not get picked up on the microphone. But just up there, as I go around the second time, the military base are obviously doing maneuvers and practice shooting and you can just, just hear the banging in the background. Anyway, right, let's carry on. Thank you, Marshall. Thank you, horses. Much appreciated horses, into the last 400, about 400 to go, maybe just under. Oh, it's the horses again. Thank you, Marshals. Thank you once again, horses. It's good to see you. you might see the horses again in the third time. Much appreciated. Cheers, Marshals. All right, in we go. Can I hop in? Can I jump in and get... I need to, I need to rest, Bertie. You won't mind me, Bert. No, okay. <laughs> I might squish you, unfortunately. No. All right, come on, last. Last little bit. 250. Yeah. Let's give the tail a cheer. Well done, tail. Well done, well guys. Done. Super effort. Well it's a lovely sunny day for it. Yeah. Here we go. Last bit here. Just round the corner. Last smidge. Thank you. Well Thank you, timers. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Thank you, tokens. Everyone calls it a GoPro, it's interesting. It's not a GoPro, it's a DJI. It's like a little GoPro. It is, it's a, but it's better than a GoPro, this is. Hi, I do recommend DJI's. 
Thank you. <laughs> right then, if I stop disturbing the token giver, talking about all the technical things, I can tell you my token was 155. So yeah, at least double what they had last week. Then on to the watch to see how that went. So 35 minutes, 10 seconds, 5.11K, an average of 6.53 per kilometre. Yep, that aches a little bit, but <laughs> he's just about to try and run in front of the camera. He's facing the wrong way, fella. I love that. I love the fact this is gimbalized and the lens can go the wrong way because people don't know which way the lens is supposed to try and get into it. I'm okay with that, all things considered, that I was in a lot of pain. And you'll be watching thinking, what are you doing, Danny? You don't have to do it each week. No, I appreciate that. I'm stubborn in that sense, but I'm really glad to have done it. I'm really glad to have come along. I wasn't going to vlog. It would have been wrong for me. It would have been remiss of me to miss it just a cracker and it's been a lovely morning and I do tend to avoid number two but it's not been overwhelming it's been superb and I do love my vlog making I do love it I, I love to be able to show you what things are rather than just tell you about it on the pod if you do listen to that there's nothing quite seeing it in 4k speaking about that 4k make sure I'm nice and clean thank you for scanning sorry I'm completely I'm not even paying attention my bad one of those annoying yeah, tourists. Well done. Thank Superb, you. thank you very much indeed. Thank you very much for volunteering. Thank you very Cheers. much. Cheers, no worries, no problem. Thank you. Danny. Hi. Hi. Did you have fun? Yeah, thank you. You did? Did it make you feel a bit better having had a tough week? Yeah, thank you. Good, there you go, right. Shall we go and do coffees? Yeah. Find the coffee van, let's have a quick <laughs> chat around the finished area, and then go on over to the coffee van. Van man, portable thingy, soon tick. There's two coffee things here. That confuses me, I'm not used to this. I know that you have alternative places to go, but what do I do? So I'm gonna go over to the hut coffee housey thing just over there. And then you've also got the coffee van by the car park. So what do I do? Do I get the coffee from the van and come and sit in the hut? Find out shortly. So here's Woody's. I realized what to do. I have two coffees, why not? Yes, that's the best thing, best solution. You don't have to have just one, you can have two coffees and I'll be super hyper on the drive back home and Steve will be wondering what's going on while I talk at him for about an hour. Anyway, let's wrap this vlog up. It's meant to be mini, it's not mini, never is. Can never do it. It's just been a fantastic occasion seeing loads of familiar faces. Lovely to come down here, beautiful morning, beautiful weather. Thank you very much weather fairies. And thank you Tidworth Park Run. Tidworth, a town that sounds like it's not real. I'd never heard of it before. It's a kind of village you'd hear like Trumpton or where the Vicar Dibley lives, but it's real. So, hello Tidworth. Thank you very much for having a park run. Truly appreciated. You've got a wonderful green space here. Just cracking. Anyway, hope you've enjoyed the video. Once again, as always, please like, subscribe. It helps us to grow. Really appreciate you watching it. Until next week, I think I'm going to Swanage. And if the weather's all right, it's gonna be a beauty. Anyway, take care guys. See you soon.